quick video. Hello world, I'm coming to you live from the garden where we are literally on the garden's last leg. Everything is on death's door. My watermelon plant, it looks like something terrible happened here. But it's just the natural death of the plant as we ascend into the fall season. <laughs> so here's the remaining watermelon focus. There is the remaining watermelon, some remaining vines, oh wow, a big spider web, and some more melon vines that attach themselves to the dead green pea plant. Over here we've got the Malabar spinach with the pretty flowers, all purple. Chiki, did I curse at any point in this video? I haven't. Okay. I'm not going to curse in this video because I want my nephew Ryan to be able to watch my videos. And he walks away when I say a, a bad words. And so this is the start of no bad words on my YouTube videos because if not, my nephew can't watch and I want him to watch. Hi, Ryan. It's me, Titi, coming from the backyard to say hello. So I'm here and I thought that this plant was going to be dead. You're not dead, but like not produce any more tomatoes. And look, to my surprise, two, three, four, five and six. And then here we've got some peppers that I'm hoping to harvest before fall comes. Over here, I have the other tomato plant. This one and that one, they're the only ones left with tomatoes, but this guy is ripening nicely. It's the moment I've been waiting for. These are like the biggest ones that grew from this plant. Got some more there, a few more there, one there, a little cluster, i.e., and a few down yonder. But yeah, that's it for everything. Oh, Cheeky's taking photos of me. And I don't like it. And here is what I harvested. One black cherry tomato, although I think this is the mutated version of a black cherry. Ave Maria Purissima. And a pink brandy wine. But you never can tell about these things because, you know, cross-pollination. So, uh, cross-pollination is the reason this happens. Let me complete my sentences some sweet cherry tomatoes and a small cucumber and this plant here is infested and it's sad because it has three little cucumbers on it right there pero si miras pa acá that means in spanish if you take a look over here you'll see how the plant is infested with aphids and not just one aphid but two two different color aphids i don't have the strength nor the will to treat this plant plant right now so this is gonna be its own for the duration of the what should I call it what am what do, you, what do you call it the duration of the summer all right world this is it focus oh focus because I want to say a curse word so bad but I'm not gonna because I love my nephew okay <laughs> I'm doing this all for you Ryan Titi's gonna try to be a, a, a person who curses a lot less all because of you I love you, little one, and to the rest of the world, goodbye.